Hello and welcome back to another computer sluggish tutorial. So today we're going to look at enabling the dark theme for Windows 10. So they obviously left this theme out but you can still enable it using the registry. So down here where it says search the web and windows we're going to type in reg edit and we're going to go enter. So now we've got the registry editor open as you can see. So First things first, we're going to go to our local machine, so here, H key, local machine, and I'm going to use the right arrow to open that wider. So now we've expanded that, we're going to go down to software, and then Microsoft, and then we're going to go down to, all the way down the bottom here, we're going to go to Windows and we're going to expand that now and we're going to go to if I just move this over a bit so you can see here we're going to go to current version and we're going to expand that again and we're now going to go all the way down till we see themes which should be somewhere here and there we go we're going to now expand that and we're going to go to personalize okay so here you can see I've already got the key in but I'm just going to delete that for a second, or in fact, actually, I can just rename that and copy that text, as that's the text that I need. So I'm just going to delete that for a second, and we're now going to right-click, and we're going to go New, and then we're going to go to DWORD32 bit value. Okay, so we're now going to select that. And I'm just going to paste in the text that I just copied. So it's apps use light theme. Okay. And we're going to go enter. Okay. So once you've done that, we're now just going to open that and make sure the value's at zero, which it is, as you can see. So I'm now just going to go OK. OK. And. Once you've done that, we're going to go all the way back to the top now. And we're just going to minimize all that, okay? So that's now the local machine done, the registry in there. <coughs> so we now need to do it in the current user. So now this applies it to the user that we're currently logged into. So this will only work for, obviously, my account now that I'm logged into. If I go onto my other user account on Windows, it will not have this theme applied okay so you would have to redo this bit the user part current user but the local machine that would still be in there the registry key okay so it's only this bit that you got to do again if you want to apply it to another user so we're now going to expand that okay same again and we're going to go down to software again and then we're going to go to Microsoft there it is and we're going to expand that and we're now going to go down to Windows and expand that and go to current version expand that and then we're looking for themes again so there it is and we're just going to expand that again and go to personalize okay so same again we're now going to go right click new and we're going to go to D word so just create that and I'm going to go control and V. So we're doing the same text again. So apps use light theme. Okay. And we're going to go enter. And I'm just going to double click in there and make sure the value set to zero. Okay. So now that's done. We should hopefully have the dark theme. If this doesn't work, try restarting your computer and yeah so that is how you apply the dark theme if you want to refer back to the light theme either delete the registry keys that we put in here so just simply like you see me do just a minute ago select it and go delete or you can even just double click and change the value to one Okay, so I'm just going to open up my control panel now and see if it has actually applied the theme. If not, I'll restart my computer and then I'll show you what it looks like. So 
let's just close the registry and we're going to go to control panel and there you go as you can see I've now got the dark theme enabled so I hope this tutorial helped remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more tutorials